Hey there, what's up everybody? It is Kim Yetta from Kim Yetta Connects and I hope everybody is well and prospering in Jesus' name. Thank you so much for um, just tuning in. I'm so grateful and so excited uh, just to share. As I've mentioned before, I never wanted to, to start a YouTube channel. I just did it because the Lord, um, and let's say, prompted, encouraged me to do it for over three years. And if you could do me a favor, um, can you hit like on this video and share it, especially on social media? That's how YouTube knows to show it to um, more and more people. One of the reasons why I decided, I don't even think I've ever shared this, excuse me. One of the reasons why I decided to go ahead and start the channel, the Lord just reminded me that there's so much like junk out there <laughs> and there's so much negativity and there's so much hate. And this is before the pandemic and all the social injustice stuff. This is before that. But God reminded me of that, reminded me that there's so much out there that is anti-God. And there's so much that draws people away from Jesus that why not start a channel that is focused on bringing people to him and growing. And that's what this channel is is all about so um today will be really really simple as i was praying about what to share today and the god told me to remind you to keep pressing and what does that mean well the apostle paul says i press on to take hold of why christ took hold of me and i feel like in my spirit that there are some of you that have kind of given up that are not pressing in to take hold of why Christ took hold of you. See, think about this. God did not save you for you to get saved and then go to work, go to church, sing in a choir and pay some bills and die. No, God saved you for a greater purpose. And so I feel like there are people that are just giving up on something greater. We are in August of 2020 and who knew it would be the kind of year it is, but don't let your circumstances define you. Don't become the um, don't become the 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 person that just lets life pass you every single day. You be the person that takes control. How do you take control and move forward? Number one, you start with prayer. Y'all knew I was going to say that. You knew, know how I am about prayer. You get before God and you say, God, what do you have for me? What should I be doing? What should 2021 and beyond look like? Number two, you get in the word and you say, God, take me to your word and show me in your word how I can be victorious, how I can succeed in life. How can I break through? See, there are some of you that's believing God for a breakthrough. So if you're believing God for a breakthrough, then you got to do your part to break through. All righty. Number three, you got to saturate yourself with the things of God and the people of God. If you're hanging around people, uh, if you are an eagle and you're hanging around buzzards, hello. If you're hanging around, you know, uh, people that's dragging you down, then you got to move. I, I love what Dr. A.R. Bernard said. He says, if you're the smartest one in your group, you need to get a new group. So you want to make sure you're surrounding yourself with people and things that's going to encourage your growth, that's going to cheer you on, that's going to push you on. I intentionally, I don't, I, I'm sorry. I intentionally, I don't, I'm not sorry. I'm not sorry. But I don't hang out with people that are not um, um, trying to do something in life. Now, I will minister to everyone watch this there's a difference i minister to everybody because that's my heart but i'm going to tell you i don't allow everybody in my spirit and in my space because i don't want that to corrupt uh, my spirit and my mind and my heart so if there are people if your boyfriend is dragging you down if you know you're trying to stop drinking and there's somebody in your life who's always wants you to turn up and drink and party. Hmm. You might need to, you might need to see now. I, I, I don't know if they're taking me where I'm trying to go in 2021. So let this video be all about pressing in so you can start taking hold of why Christ took hold of you. 2021 is like tomorrow. It's like right around the corner. Don't stay the same. Fight for change. That's what I'm doing. 
Come on now. Let's go.